What's going on, everybody? Krista B here, digital content producer for WBLS, filling in for my girl, Just Nick. And this week on The Rewind, Afonso Ribeiro refuses to work with Tyler Perry. Tay Diggs has no energy for love. And is Sterling K. Brown really throwing shade at J-Lo? Let's get into it. Actor Tay Diggs finally opens up about his love life and reveals that he is done looking for love. During a recent interview with US Weekly, he said that he truly has no energy for it. I have no idea what I'm doing. I really don't, so I'm just chilling out. He added that he was overwhelmed with the amount of dating apps that are out there as well. Tay, I feel you. There is a lot happening on social media and on these dating apps. Take your time. Love will find you. If you remember, Tay Diggs was dating reality TV star April Jones in 2022. The couple quietly ended their relationship in 2023. Jones would later address the breakup on social media and said that she was the one who left the relationship. Now, Sterling K. Brown has social media buzzing. He recently had fans believing that he was over Jennifer Lopez. While promoting their current movie Atlas, the two of them were asked what were their favorite comfort foods. J-Lo would respond with, I grew up Puerto Rican, so I like rice and beans. Brown, seemingly annoyed with J-Lo's response, mocked her and said, are you Puerto Rican? Get out of here. He continued by saying his favorite foods in Spanish, arroz, frijoles, me gusta French toast. Fans immediately felt the shade that was being thrown at Lopez and loved every minute of it. One Twitter user even said, Sterling K. Brown is all of us. Girl, we know you're Puerto Rican and from the Bronx. J-Lo, girl, I'm Puerto Rican too. Yo soy Boricua. What's up? Lopez has been under heavy criticism since her infamous bodega order. You remember the ham and cheese on the roll with the orange drink, if you know you know, and the bag of chips? <laughs> Jennifer Lopez had to cancel a lot of her tour dates due to poor ticket sales and because both her movie and album flopped. Now one thing that won't flop is Alfonso Ribeiro's career. He recently stated that one thing he will not do is work with Tyler Perry ever again. After sharing that his career has been stifled after his role as Carlton Banks in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, a fan has suggested that he should work with Tyler Perry. However, the actor did not approve of that comment and said, I don't need or ever want that man to do anything for me. His response left fans surprised, but they seem to forget that the two have worked together before. Ribeiro had directed 12 episodes of Perry's Meet the Browns, but things took a turn when an actor claimed that he was forced to play a gay role or he was at risk of losing his job. It was also one of the episodes that Ribeiro had directed. Although he has been typecasted, Alfonso Ribeiro has had a successful career. In 2014, he competed in one in Dancing with the Stars. He will go on to host a show in 2022. He also is the host of America's Funniest Home Videos. I guess he doesn't need Tyler Perry after all. That's all for today's show. We'll see you back here next week.